Adam Levine denies claims that he cheated on wife Bahati Prinsloo. The Maroon 5 frontman is shutting down allegations that he had an affair with Instagram model Sumner Stroh. On September 20th, Adam takes to IG writing, quote, A lot is being said about me right now and I want to clear the air. I used poor judgment in speaking with anyone other than my wife in any kind of flirtatious manner. I did not have an affair. Nevertheless, I crossed the line during a regrettable period in my life. He continues, in certain instances, it became inappropriate. I have addressed that and taken proactive steps to remedy this with my family. Levine adds, my wife and my family is all I care about in this world. To be this naive and stupid enough to risk the only thing that truly matters to me was the greatest mistake I could ever make. I will never make it again. I take full responsibility. We will get through it, and we will get through it together. The statement follows Sumner's claims on TikTok that she and Adam were seeing each other for about a year. The model said in a post on September 19th, At the time, I was young, I was naive, and quite frankly, I feel exploited. I wasn't in the scene like I am now, so I was definitely easily manipulated. The model posted alleged screenshots of DMs with the singer, including one from June. Sumner claims Levine sent her a message asking, I'm having another baby, and if it's a boy, I really want to name it Sumner. You okay with that? Dead serious. Adam and wife Bahati, who married in 2014, recently announced they are expecting their third child together. Just days ago, Bahati shared the first image of her baby bump with followers. In a follow-up post, Sumner apologized to Bahati and the couple's two other children, saying, quote, In retrospect, I wish I would have questioned things more. I wish I wasn't so naive, but being naive is not an excuse for what I did and the role I played in this. Adding, I'm not the one who's really getting hurt here. It's Bahati and her children. And for that, I'm so, so sorry.